Hi everyone, I'm Ella. So today I am making my monthly bullet journal setup for August 2020. I got inspiration from one of my um, hats I use all the time, and I decide to paint some uh, woman's hat. And black and red is one of my favorite uh, color combination. So I did some research on a website and find some beautiful old time uh, woman's hat style. And I uh, recreated some of them. And I hope you like it. In this setup, I doodle total 45 women's hats. Uh, there are four main um, categories, uh, which is beret, fascinators, um, fedora, and turban. I learned some words due to this project. In this setup, I basically use the three pens. Um, all of them are uh, belongs to Tongbo. The main black liner is one of my favorite uh, liner pen, uh, which is Tongbo Calligraphy Pen, and I'm using the soft pointed one. Um, and the red one is dual brush, water based. Um, number is eight um, forty seven. And the gray, the light gray I'm using for the shadow is N75. Um, all the, the material will be listed in the description box. Please check it out.
although the witch's hat doesn't belong to any category I mentioned before, but how can I miss a witch's hat? <laughs> So the basic uh, technique to make a doodle picture looks more realistic instead of um, flat is to use different uh, intensity of the line. So the thicker line can indicate the shadow or the part you want to emphasize and other part use very thin line. That's it. In my journal, I always put a monthly goal page after the cover page. 
Um, and I used to have lots of goals,、um, but in the pandemic, I changed the monthly goal to focus because、um, with a little boy and at home, I can hardly do anything. So、um, for a few months already, I only want to focus on three things, which is、um, stay healthier. Um, and take care of my kid, be with him to study and play, and、um, post one video per week. That's it. You must recognize this hat.、Um, yes, it's、um, the one、uh, Audrey Hepburn wore at breakfast at Tiffany's. And I find this、uh, quote online. The original one is: "I wear a hat to keep my ideas warm, and I change the warm to cool." The next page is for me to write down、uh, people I appreciated, and also write down the beautiful quotes I either read or listen、uh, from the Audible book. I always want to remind myself、uh, in the morning when I'm writing a journal、um, to remind myself what's the most important thing in life.
here we go. This is the page uh, I am using it to track my mood. If you watch my previous uh, bullet journal setup, you might realize that I always use a scale instead of color to track my mood. But I want to try something new this time. Um, so I'm using four different colors to track my mood. The darkest uh, gray is indicating that I'm not that happy or I'm a little bit down and uh, the red one indicate I am obviously in a good mood so let's see uh, how it will look like and uh, does it work for me but um, it's good to try something new This month, I drew uh, lots of lines in my sleep tracker um, so it will look neat and precise when I fill my uh, highlighter. It took lots of time, but I think it's worth it. I like it clean and neat. So here we go, happy tracker. Um, I am tracking a few things in my um, tracker, but if I need to eliminate um, most of them, I will do it, but I will keep three things, which I have been doing for quite a long time, and I will keep doing it, which is um, my morning routine. I do three things, bullet journal, art journal, and practicing calligraphy. That's the most important thing I need to do every day in the morning. My last but not least, uh, YouTube ideas, um, inspiration sheet. I hope I can be more creative uh, and create some ideas for uh, painting and for inspiration.
Finally, my favorite part of this setup is my Dutch door weekly spreadsheet. And I got this um, inspiration from Janison Studio. Um, thank you very much for that idea. And let's finally walk through my uh, August setup. That's it for today. Thank you so much for watching and see you next week. Bye.